the only instructions I got was let a bit of air out of the tyres, so... Hello? Uh, so I told you to let air out of your tyres. And I told you to come to uh, for mana. I told you we were going to see uh, the fast track was fit to do a bank job. Yeah. I'm, what I'm seeing here is I don't think I've let enough air out of my tyres, maybe. Well. What you're seeing here is a 234 Valtra on a five leg sumo subsoiler down beside the Colebrook River. Now, the 234 Valtra is absolutely snoring at sun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm just studying about there. She's, uh, she's bossing it, hasn't she? She is bossing it. He has her into the bowels. <laughs> ah, I don't know if my wee GoPro can show it, but look at the wee sick sheep over there. <laughs> that thing's not even coughing. I'm not even coughing. We better get shots of something working, because that's might be short left. What do you think of the Lang Longs? Are they? <laughs> la 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 long. <laughs> la 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 long long me Lang Long Lang. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm dog laughing at that. Four wolves could be dug very quickly. <laughs> You're right. Ah, no, I have faith on her. I'm impressed because like they're not like everybody's like oh they're not a field tractor blah 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 you know like the old one wouldn't have a machine of doing this. Yeah, you get better tires. Like the manual mode pushing her on, she would take up more of a bit. she has the power there in the manual mode. It's just she just can't get it down. We've 20 pound of pressure in them tires. We're just cautious about letting them down too far because, like, let's be honest, they're not a they're not a high end brand of tire, and we were just unsure what their abilities were in the field, and we didn't want to be spinning tires and rims and have her set there. Four point nine in the cruise control. If you definitely, if you had a they got an AF or a VF tyre on and a, a lot more pressure out of it to allow her to grip. She does have the power there to pull it faster. She does try hard. Like, that engine's very torquey. And, like, even you hang her down there in manual mode or that, she does try her best for you. Like, definitely like it. I'd be very happy with this as an all-round, I think she'd be a super all-round tractor, like, like, it's able to do that, it's able to go and cope with haulage work, like, we all know its capabilities there, they're probably the best in the market for that job. 
I don't think it's a bad shout pulling a, a five leg subsoiler in Fermanagh on ground that's been flooded and uh, it seems pretty tight now to be fair. So it does. Got the Fermanagh weather of the day anyway. Sunshine has passed month and you come to Fermanagh and it rains. Explaining to my wee camera what's going on here. Uh, Gary's outside the pickup window there. You can see him there, and uh, I'm in the pickup. And Barry is flat out up and down the field here with the two, three, four. And uh, if anybody remembers from a couple of years ago, we brought a two, three, four here with a set of tyres on it, and it really struggled on Barry's uh, subsoiler and uh, buried a big 20 acre field to do down in beside the Coalbrook River here and it's absolutely it's real tough ground Barry was saying this this ground can be literally uh, a lot of feet underwater in the bad time it's the same river flooded his yard not that long ago so we brought the fast track down because we wanted to tick a few boxes one is she a tractor so Gary you've been running the fast track on the subsoiler, she did better than the two, three, four we had here the last time. But how did it do? I I was fairly impressed now with the JCB, but you will probably have a fairly good weight advantage uh, to actually get some of that power down. Like the weight of that tractor will be a big advantage for this job. Yours is remapped, hasn't it? It's mapped out it. <laughs> the the grassman Valtra didn't impress me, just dug holes and couldn't get the grip down to the ground at all and was making no use of the power. To be fair, the JCB, even on them slightly more budget range tyres, uh, she made a fairly good attempt. Now the weight of her would be a big help. She's nine and a half ton dead, we measure her by. But now that's with a ton weight on the back of her already. Yeah, I think this Valtra, she sits now, is somewhere around about eight and a half, with the weights and all on her. Aye, so she, there is that, there is that difference. Well, well, look, Barry, hopefully if conditions get relaxed a little bit, we'd love to throw this tractor down to you for a couple of days um, at the old silage situation. And I believe you have a brand new red rock coming, uh, 20 foot, am I right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, hopefully, I think red rock production is still ticking along, so hopefully it should be here later in the month, uh, 20 foot. Well, we have a 20 foot trailer uh, K2 in from England so it'll be very interesting to take a wee look and see how those two trailers compare. That's what we would like to do if we can. Yeah, yeah. No, for man will be the place to test them between small gaps, narrow roads and wet lands and good steep hills is bound to give you a wee challenge. Oh, I'll be in the pick up, don't panic. <laughs> 